There you are. Hello, friends. We are on the last class for Wednesday, uh, Wednesday the 10th, and this is Bible class. So last time we were together, we did our Bible test on our last verse. So today we've got a new verse. It's a long one, so bear with me, but um, I think you'll do fine with it. And for today, we're going to write the verse, and then we're going to practice it three times. So you're actually going to write it four times on your paper, and I'll show you how to do it. I'm going to try something new today. I'm going to pull up a Jamboard on the screen share, and then I'm going to try to flip to a new Jamboard and flip back and forth between the old and the new. So we'll see how this one goes. We're always trying some new things to improve our technology. So let me get your screen share. Here we go. And here's your Bible verse. And here I'm sharing it up. Now, let me make it bigger. There it is. Now, this is where I can pull up a new, a new Jamboard and you see it looks like I lost it, but I didn't lose it. If you can't see this, it's okay. I'll tell you what to do. Just get a plain piece of paper, which you're going to use anyway. Kind of when you get the copy paper, the white paper that's in your packet, it kind of looks like a Jamboard if you turn it sideways. So that's what we're going to use for your Jamboard. Now, I've written a Jamboard over here. I hope you can see it now. This is the one with the Bible verse on it. I'm going to start doing these a little different. I've been working on my format for these, and I think I like this one, where we've got the Bible verse in the big sticky note here. And then here I have the, um, the place where the Bible verse is found. Um, this is 2 Thessalonians verse one, chapter one, verse three, all right? And then I've got the Bible verse written out on the big sticky note. And then down here at the bottom, these are the five key words. I think I'll make it a little bit easier for you. Um, you know how when we do our Bible test, I'll give you this and then I'll take some of the words out and put blanks in there and then put the words over on the side for you to fill in the blanks your word choices. Well, today I'm going to give it to you right off the bat, right off the get-go this time so that you'll know that when we do our test on this on Friday or whenever we do our test, when we're at the end of the chapter, these are the words that go in it, okay? Um, also, if I can remember, at the beginning of Bible, you know how we practice these every morning for morning work? Still a good time to do this every morning for morning work. So at the top, um, every time we do Bible, we'll try to call your attention back to practice these a little bit. Make sure you're writing them down. I've given you plenty of paper. Um, anywhere you can write it down, it would be great. Or just read it. Um, maybe we'll try to try to remember to do it as well. Okay, so today's Bible verse is from 2 Thessalonians chapter one, verse three, and it says, we are bound to thank God always for you, brethren, as is fitting because your faith grows exceedingly and the love of every one of you all abounds toward each other. Man, that's long. That's okay. You can handle it today. Your key words over here are toward. There it is right there. God, there he is right up there. Faith, I see that right there. Brethren, looks like it's right there. And love, right in there. Okay, so all you have to do is put these words in the right places. Hopefully that'll make it a little easier to study for you. Okay, so when you come over to your board, here's what I want you to do, or your paper rather. You're going to just take your paper like we always do. And we're going to make a window. Okay. Nice big window. I can use my pen on this, but let me change my parameters here. Let's do marker. Go back. And here we go. Okay. 
And in each window up here, you were going to write the Bible verse, okay? And it's right here. You can write this Bible verse over here. Then you're going to write it over here. Then you're going to write it over here and over here, okay? If you want to do it, you can do it once every day to help you practice, or you can do all four right now. It's totally up to you. But you know that when you practice, the more you practice, the better your grade is when we do this final test. Okay. Um, I'm going to try a couple of my tricks here. Yeah, I can use my pointer on that. I'm wondering if you can see that when I use my pointer. Um, hope so. That'd be cool if we can use the pointer on that. So we'll see what, what that does. See if we can get that to work. Also try a highlighter, see if that works. Whoops. Ah, oh, look at that. Look what we found. Oh no, it just colors all it in and we can't see it anymore. Well, that was cool. You could my, maybe use a highlighter on it. Hmm. We learned some new things today. Thanks for helping me out. Anyway, come back, write your Bible verse, bring it back to your own Jamboard and write it on your Jamboard right over here, okay? If it helps you to study and you brought your highlighter home, you can take your highlighter and highlight the word. Oh, I guess it's not highlighting it now. There it is, you can see it under there. Very cool, we learned something new today. Anyway, write your Bible verse four times and you're good to go. I love you, I will see you tomorrow for English. Have a good day.